Welcome back to the channel. My name is Ellipsis. Happy Saturday. So this week we had two openings of Vivid Voltage. We opened 40 packs in total um, to really see if we could add too much to the binder that's currently about halfway. So uh, let's take a quick look through the binder and then we'll uh, we'll see what cards we can add. We didn't do too amazingly. We actually in the end we managed to pull about 30 cards that we need to add but uh, nothing for the back end of the binder unfortunately out of 40 packs which is quite rough and um, mainly reverses so some progress we can make but uh, maybe not as much as typically we would hope so let's flick through the binder see where we're currently at and then we'll put all the cards into the binder and then we'll do a quick summary at the end so here is the binder. So we have our energy page like normal. And as you'll see, a lot of reverses, some Vs, Vmaxes still required. But uh, mostly what, what we would have hoped for and uh, would have liked to have seen would be some of the bigger, uh, you know, trainer gallery stuff, some of the, the sort of full art Pokemon, rainbow cards, uh, gold cards but uh, it just wasn't to be. And as I understand it, it's a particularly hard set in terms of pull rates, so shouldn't have been expected to be able to get too much really, but every now and again I've opened reg you know, uh, individual packs from different products, and I've pulled some pretty good cards, so I think uh, you're either, you either get the luck when it, when it comes, or uh, you know, you're out of luck. So there you go, we've kind of, these lines typically indicate where reverses go, unless you've got uh, Vs and Vmaxes in the mix. But as you can see, most of those rows are uh, empty at the moment. We did pull two of those this week, which is a shame. It would have been nice if we could have pulled something else that we did need. But we got two Colossal. And then... Moving on through, some pages are relatively empty. We did get another Aegis Slash, which kind of sucked. And we got one each of the Togekiss, Togekiss VMAX. So the pools that we did get, the, the big pools, I guess, um, were just duplicates. So that is unfortunate but that's the way it goes in collecting sometimes. Uh, this is where you get to the last of the trainer cards and the start of the full art Pokemons. Um, um, yeah, we didn't we didn't pull anything, so we've got a completely blank page there, which is terrible to look at, and I'm gonna have to start buying some singles, I think, just to satisfy my eyes, so that every time I flick through the binder, I don't just see this huge sea of empty slots on that those pages. and. This is where the golds come up to. And yeah, we did pull a duplicate of Hero's Medal. Again, kind of sucks, but you know, that's the way it goes sometimes. So that's the binder. And let's start putting in all of these 30 cards. Put a bit of music on, a bit chill. And uh, yeah, at the end, we'll just do a quick summary just to see what's left. And uh, this is going to be one of those binders where, yeah, I think singles come into play straight after this, really. I'd, I don't see the sense in opening another bunch of uh, Vivid Voltage packs other than potentially the occasional one if we open a product and we find that there's a, a, a single Vivid Voltage pack inside. So sit back, grab a coffee, and uh, let's just populate this binder. <laughs>
So there you go. Short and sweet, as I said. A lot of reverses. Uh, no real big progress for the back of the binder, sadly. But um, still nice to see quite a lot of reverses going in. Um, a couple of hollows. And now we get a clear picture, really, of what we still need to uh, to buy as singles, really. So let's have a another quick run through see how the binder looks now some pages you know we could add a few cards in each others we had to skip through them so nothing new to add to this page the um the backwards pokemon card is just to to signify that there's maybe a v or a radiant and there is no card if i'm going to keep to my reverse regular combination um there's no card that can go there so that will in eventually become um, a V-star marker, probably. Turn backwards, so it's the black side, so that you just see the detail of the V-star um, Pokeball, but um, it just helps fill that gap, make it look a bit uh, a bit neater to the way that I like them to look. Uh, I just, I haven't got enough V-star markers for this binder yet, so I need to open some more of the later Sword and Shield sets, which have V-star markers in them, and once I get enough of them, then I'll, I'll put them in the spaces in this binder. So we did finally manage to pull a Shaman in reverse. Happy with either, really. So, uh, so yeah, just being able to just gradually chip away at most pages, I think, was nice. I did question myself as to whether I had a Charizard card already, and I did. So we couldn't add one into the binder, but it was still nice to pull an extra one. But we did get a Charmeleon to add. So all we're looking for in his evolution line is really the reverse of Charizard. So, let's say, one, two cards per page average, I guess. That's quite a nice bit of progress to make. But uh, yeah, still looking for a lot of VMAXs. We got the V of Dalmanitan, but we didn't get the VMAX. We got the V of Pikachu, but we didn't get the VMAX. And the VMAXs that we did get, unfortunately, you know, duplicates. Nice to be able to put the Pikachu into the binder though. And on this page we actually did pretty good. We, we could put the Pikachu, Voltorb, Electrode and the Zapdos. Nice to see some sort of continuity all the way through a page. So we've got that entire middle row completely done. And uh, yeah, some pages actually, you know, a handful of singles and we'd be able to complete them. So I'm hoping to uh, to start that process fairly soon i'll start looking for singles online if anyone knows of any really good websites in the uk to buy singles from i know of a couple but they're quite limited in terms of uh what sets they do whether they do reverses as well uh so yeah any advice would be great if you know of somewhere that can uh, you can get singles quite easily and maybe have a fairly conclusive set list as well to be able to pick from. eBay's great, but you have to be so specific and so uh, it's time consuming going through looking for suppliers or you know eBay sellers that have the right set and the cards in stock. Most of the time you click on their uh, on their page and uh, there's like a You'll have a drop down, it will say all of the different cards from the set, but then they're not available or they're out of stock. So if I could find one place that um, could kind of meet all the requirements and I could just do a massive order from with, I don't know, 50, 60 individual single cards, that would be great. So yeah, getting through again, you know, nothing new to add there because we already had them, but um, still nice to see a sort of two-thirds complete page. Trainers are actually looking pretty solid. Just the reverse beauty and the reverse Sir Chester Bath needed. And again, uh, we actually need a regular Leon. Uh, but reverses for everything else. And then the reverses for the different energy types. And uh, yeah, then we get into the full arts, which, as I said, no progress for this week, which is unfortunate, but it's okay. And uh, we get through to the golds. Uh, I actually pulled that one in France. I remember that. Um, so as I said, it's just it's 
it's the luck of the draw. You know, you've got random packs lying around. They're in different collection boxes, etc. Um, and that's the case with that one. That came out of uh, a random pack from a collection box that I put into the custom booster box that I took to France to open each day. Just a random bit of luck. But we pull a gold and uh, it goes into the binder. But we open, um, you know, a random handful of of new packs uh, that just came from a, a fairly well-established UK online seller. Um, and, you know, we pull a double of of what we've already got. But interestingly, that came from a bad code card. So I'm curious why that happened, whether there was a phase where maybe Vivid Voltage suffered from bad code cards. I've had the same experience with Fusion Strike in the past. I had a booster box, which essentially was all the bad code cards were actually where the pools were. So, yeah, it's interesting. I do have this page as well. Um, these are Cosmos foil versions of some of the cards in the set. So these are kind of, for a master set collector, they're also in the list of things that you need to, to include if you want to complete a full master set. Um, one of the other elements it can be um, the trickle trade sets. Some of those actually, when you look at the the set lists for particular uh, particular sets, the set will include individual cards that have come from trickle trade because trickle trade isn't a particular set in itself. They're reprints from other cards from previous sets. So always keep an eye out if you are planning to master set. Always keep an eye out on something like the Poe Collector app. Uh, and that will detail which cards you'll also need in order to uh, to tick off and complete a master set. So that is the Vivid Voltage Binder. There you go. Um, as I said, I will I will chip away with singles. Um, I will be back next week. Monday we're going to be uh, spinning the wheel for the winner of the Trickle Trade 2023 complete set of 30 cards. If you haven't entered already, uh, make sure that you do and make sure that you watch the video that that uh, giveaway is in to uh, to understand how you can enter the giveaway. I'm going to spin it at lunchtime on Monday UK time. So uh, that's nine hours difference from West Coast and five hours difference from East Coast. So calculate that yourselves. And if you want to be involved, make sure you get in in time. I would recommend entering the giveaway, putting your answer in the comments for the previous video by probably the last thing on Sunday night, just so you have a guaranteed chance to, to be included in the, the wheel spin. So good luck to whoever wins that. I will see you hopefully for that video where we spin the wheel. And it just remains to be said that I hope you have a really nice weekend and uh, yeah, until we until we see each other again. Take care of yourselves and I'll see you soon. Bye.